for coming. My name is Oliver Powell, the Anger Canadian. So in our last video of this series, I was the American submarine and I got torpedoed and depth charged and all that good jazz and ended up losing. Uh, but I scored three hits with my torpedoes the last second. So it is what it is. So now this is time to showcase submarine combat. So the two from those well i got my aircraft carrier the ranger um the only real way to defend against submarines in this one is to either take out the destroyers of the other team so that your submarines will have less people hunting them or if the submarine is surfaced then they're susceptible to um rockets or uh bobs uh, I got, well, submarine a submarine, but I got this, the lander, um, my cruiser, and, uh, you know, he can hold his own for a while, um, but uh, he has the depth charges, but he's not as maneuverable as the destroyers. And I got the French one, but I like the Asian one. Uh, she's fast, uh, torpedoes. Uh, I've done some upgrading with her, so I was able to get um, her reduces the reload time, which is great. Um, so uh, torpedoes are faster, but their range is cut down. And I had another one I did to give me a little bit more range to counteract that, but so I know so that's the one I'm using. And her guns are pretty fast to reload, so. Um, but yeah, I mean, I played the submarines all day. Like, not today, but uh, my other video and the other two I just did. Um, still like the German U-boat as the best underwater maneuverability. Um, which, is like I pointed out in the last video near the end, was that um, I... Yeah, I was able to, you're able to, uh, underwater maneuverability. Like the American one is more maneuverable on the surface, but how often you're on the surface as a submarine? Not really. And the German U-boats is more maneuverable underwater, and that's when, especially get those anti-submarine kills, or even like kills in general, you need to be ahead of your target. So the torpedoes can swing onto you. But yeah, the cruisers and the uh, destroyers have depth charges, which is what's key uh, for me, anyhow. See, which is the new consumable for this is the G key. Um, so that's pretty cool because you can, um, and I've seen, and so the key to this is to go in line. Battle like directly over. So again, I given my team a little battle cry. Oh, uh, I can hear some people falling back. I like this model too, and also I can put some war paint on her, some camouflage. So, oh yeah, nice little ship. Not a lot of health though. 1400 health points so let's see I'm going to probably go for Delta I want to probably just be a little shy or no yeah right in front of the island kind of wait for my targets to come to me I'm not that good with surface ships like I said before I um overconfident I guess <laughs> I end up getting sunk which you might see so I like the little details of this map you got this little castle here from God knows what so. with this submarine map this just seems to be the one they keep on repeating I got some other ships are close by there's a submarine ours this little periscope. Autopilot mode 
disabled. Looks like I was about to hit it. So yeah, my consumables, I got the engine boost and I got the uh, smoke screen. And then the new one specifically for them is the depth of charge is someone shooting at me. We got a battleship. are more maneuverable than the battleships, so I might be able to get a little bit, see if I can get closer and get them with some torpedoes. Oh, there's a destroyer there. Okay, I might be able to get go around this island and get him. I'll give him a couple more pot shots while I... Oh, torpedoes? Oh, fuck, 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 fuck! Damn it. Hull breach. We're taking on water quickly. Problem solved, sir. Fuck me. See, might not even get a chance to do any submarine kills. Turn, 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 turn. I lost track of my fucking. See me or they don't care. But I'll take it. Might rate my torpedoes. That might be a good thing. Enemy submarine spotted. Where is? Oh, there's one. Is he already dead. I think he's sinking. Yeah, he's sinking already. Where's that sub? Where is he? He's aft. Eight kilometers away. I think I might be able to get him. Engine boost activated. I can survive.
Fuck. That's what I was talking about, getting overconfident and stuff, but I did better than I normally do. I was able to get that destroyer with my torpedoes, and I got six torpedo shots. My damage dealt got higher. I should have focused on that submarine, but oh well. Another American. This guy's got his pink, so he's caused some, you know, shit like team killing or something. Some sort of penalty. Anyhow, I don't want to focus on someone else's game while I'm making my own video. So, I mean, I feel like I did better than normal. So, yes, exit the battle. That is loading. But anyhow, so yeah. Um, so hopefully, yeah, you don't get to experience depth charges. But what I do, a little visual aid, um, bear with me here, is if that's me, the silly putty container, and there's your fucking submarine, arts and crafts portion of the show. And if you detect your submarine, like the little pink turret that it is, then you go over it. Like directly, and then right as you're approaching it, right around here, that's when you release your depth charges, and you go right over in a straight line, and then the depth charges are on both sides, and some are on the top, and you get maximum damage that way. Um, and I've seen some players try to go like on the side or whatever, and if the submarine's already going that way, and then you release it, like you're only going to get like a little bit, so. It's a very tricky thing to do, but I've done it a couple of times. Um, so yeah, anyhow, that's that. So thank you all for watching. Have yourself a great evening, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>